Fortunately or unfortunately, however you see it, uh, we heard finally from the Gilbert police chief, uh, and you and I just thought he was very unimpressive, hasn't led, hasn't been in front of a microphone, uh, hasn't done any of this stuff. Hasn't, he's not reassuring the public. Actually, he blamed parents today. Uh, you gave us the wrong info. Some of it was bad. Um, you know, now you, some of you aren't coming forward. Okay. Uh, if you listened, we're asking you to call, get some quick reaction. We've got some folks in the East Valley who want to get in here, Chad. Uh, Mo and Gilbert. All right, Mo, what'd you think? Yeah, I, did, I am very disappointed as a resident of Gilbert. It didn't sound reassuring at all what he said or, or you know, what they're doing. The other thing I felt is like it, it kind of sounded like I sent a patrolman out there, but I never assigned a detective to it on everything. It just, I would have liked to have heard, yeah, I have detectives working on it, this and that. It just almost sounded like he only assigned a patrolman. That was it. And the patrolman, you know, said, well, I can't find it, you know, don't know who the guy is. And it's, it's, it's just discouraging. Yeah. Uh, I, th- I took that, too. No, I'm not reassured by this guy. There was it, it, there was no follow-up. It's almost like, hey, go take a report, and then we're going to move on. We're going to take a report of the beating, and then we're going to shelve it. Yeah. Which is exactly, which is exactly what they did. They had to reopen uh, a lot they, of these yeah, cases. Yeah, a lot of these cases. Mike in Queen Creek, what did you think about uh, uh, the press conference? Hey, guys. Thanks for having me. I was not impressed with this guy. I, I have not been impressed with how he's been handling this mess. I live in Queen Creek, and both of my kids are in high school in Gilbert. My daughter knows one of the kids in there are one of these goons, as they call for themselves. So it really pisses me off that they have let this go on for so long. And then just like that over here in Queen Creek, we know seven people. We're, we're standing. You know, if I went out there and beat somebody to death, I'd be in jail right now. How come these people are not being held accountable for beating these people? This is just absolutely ridiculous. And if you go on Facebook for Gilbert, try to make, try to put in a comment on what they're putting on their bull crap. You can't. They won't even let you comment on it. So I am just, I am just so fed up. I'm even thinking about taking my kids out of Gilbert High Schools. Wow, wow, wow. another uh, not satisfied uh, parent that, and resident. That. That's someone who's got kids and is scared. Yeah. And the police chief had a chance today to talk to Mike. To reassure. To reassure people like Mike. And he failed miserably. He failed miserably. Yeah. Uh, let's get to grab another one here. Tim in Phoenix. Tim, what would you think of that? Yeah, hey, um, I listened to part of his uh, conversation and wish he could have done better. But then again, when I listened to you guys on the radio... Gatos especially sounds like an angry, bitter Monday morning quarterback. I think you've diminished yourself in the way you carry on about this. Yeah, I yeah, guess I, I like just I guess I just result. care about kids getting beat up, Tim, and maybe you don't. You should be ticked off too. You should be angry. I am angry, Tim, and I'm glad I sound angry to you. Because if I sat here and didn't sound angry, that means I don't care, and I do care. I care deeply about Arizona. I care deep, deeply about these kids. So if you say I- I'm sitting here and I'm yelling and I'm angry, you're damn right. And, and let's Do I not- have to yell? You're damn right I'm angry because these guys in Gilbert did nothing, nothing. They threw some of these cases out. You're damn right I'm angry. And you should be too. Maybe you don't have kids and you don't know what it feels like. We just had a dad call and say what? He might move out of Gilbert. He might move his kids out of the high school. He's angry. Tim, I'm sorry you're not angry. I'm sorry you're not angry. Maybe you're not a human being. Because I think everybody's angry here. And if you're not, maybe you're just like the police chief. Because I'll tell you what, he wasn't angry. And I got a problem with that. Absolutely. You heard it right there. Thanks for watching Gatos and Chad. Click to watch more and tap the button in the middle to subscribe to KTAR News.